Hi, I'm Justin. I'm Andrew. I'm Nick. I'm Eric. And we are Rocket to the Moon. It's kind of crazy because they're all kind of, they all bought their tickets. The, the whole tour sold out in like four minutes and so they're all pretty lucky to get them, I think. And so they're yeah. all like crazy and really loud. They're fun though. Super like small rooms too and everybody just goes <laughs> wild. You feel they're all stoked passion. to be there, yeah. And it's very hot. They, it's all feel, really, they all feel very special to be there. Like you mm -hmm. said, they all sold yeah. out really quick. So, you know, they kind of feel... Like they deserve to be there because they're the fastest ones to get the tickets. Yeah. And they do, and they they do a lot of stuff for all time. They're on their their street team and stuff, and so they they do deserve to be there. You know? It's a totally different audience for sure. It's a, I mean obviously a younger audience. Um, yeah. Both of them are pretty much all girls. Yeah. yeah. I don't think that that's pretty much the same. Except but, uh, the all time Hanson fans were all time lows fans' age when they were listening to Hanson back in the day. So. Yeah. Their uh, all time low fans are. I'd say a little louder and rowdier, whereas the Hanson fans kind of chill a little more and listen. Um, like, there's a little more screaming at the Hell Time Low shows, which is cool. It's, we got the best of both worlds. Yeah, know. it's a lot of yeah, energy. They both, I mean, there's great things about both crowds. It's hard to say which is more fun to play for, you know? They both have their strong songs. There's uh, the band Perry. Really like them. They have that new song, If I Die Young. I've been listening to a lot of Band of Horses. And I would say... <laughs> horse the band. Horse the band. Of course, the band. Horse the band. <laughs> I like Justin said, I got into that, the band Perry, too. That CD's really good. And then all Taylor Swift's new songs that she's putting out. And Some really uh, cool things she's doing. Yeah, yeah, she's a genius. We're in Green River. Oh, I, a lot yeah, too. the Green River Ordinance acoustic EP they release. It's amazing. I like the new <laughs> Land of Talk album a lot. That's cool. We listen to a lot of Sirius and satellite radio. Nine is on nine. We have it in our van, so. Yeah, we've been listening to a lot of Informer like by Snow. <laughs> yeah, lots of Snow. Thanks Pretty too. good really so good. far. Yeah. I've been reading a lot of the reviews on iTunes, and a lot of people like it. There's like, you know, three or four that are like, this is stupid. Yeah. But I think for the most part, a lot of the reviews are like, I really yeah. like the way that this band, you know, keeps maturing, and you never really know what you're going to get with their next, you know, CD, which is yeah. cool for us because it kind of leaves the door open for what yeah. we want to do next, you know. From what I've read on the iTunes kind of comments, they like when bands step out and do something not in their yeah. comfort zone. Because you can get the not same the... CD every time the band releases the yeah. CD. It's just new songs that sound like the last record, you know? But I think for us, like, the kids that have been commenting on it said that, that that's one thing they like about our band is that, you know, Greetings From is way different from On Your Side, and On Your Side is way different from, you know, the Rainy Day Sessions. So you don't really know what's going to happen next for our band, but it's pretty cool. We want to do, like, <laughs> man vs. food challenges and stuff like that. Yeah. We want to look on the food... Food Network website and try yeah. to get all the best diners, drive-ins, and I, lives type stuff. Yeah, I usually Google Man vs. Food and then whatever major city we're in, and then I look at the places that he goes to. I try to go there. We went. A few of us went to the Crab Pot in Seattle, which was fun. And uh, excellent veggie burgers. <laughs> <laughs> Not known for their veggie burgers. <laughs> when we can, you know, step out into the. Into when we have people to buy us dinner, room. let's say. We but like for the most part, around. we usually live off. Chipotle, Panera Bread, yeah, and then different variations of both of those. It's cool. We, I'm glad we were all together the first time we heard yeah. it and stuff. Um, or that thing you do moment. Yeah, as yeah. I always say it's kind of bizarre seeing. I watched it on TV. I watched it by myself and just was bawling. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Not because of the song. That was before the song. Yeah, because of Casey was getting <laughs> yeah, exactly.